Hi everybody, Dr. Becky, retired functional medicine practitioner, coming to you today. And y'all might be wondering, well, first of all, dang it, there's a lot more people cutting grass next door. Sorry about that, I'll keep this brief. But if you're wondering why did I come to you looking like a half-drowned rat with speckles still in my lenses and my hair a mess, I just finished up with my water aerobics class. And I don't want y'all to think that this is just some wimpy, wimpy little floating in the water kind of um, water aerobics class. This is resistance training, the likes of which I have never experienced before. These old people, they don't play around. And as you likely know, if you're tuning in and you follow and subscribe to the channel, you know that I'm here because I want to share tips and tricks, just simple lifestyle tips and tricks that don't cost you any money to save your brain. Again, my mom and dad died because of Alzheimer's disease and I'm gonna do everything I can to save my brain and the resistance that you can get from an incredible water aerobics class does something to help the brain create a neurochemical that's called brain-derived neurotrophic factor also just called BDNF. And so I spent an hour in the water huffing and a puffing and doing everything I could with that resistance training so that I could make my share of BDNF so that I can make brand new brain cells. And I'm sure that you all want to make brand new brain cells too. So figure out a resistance training protocol you like, whether that's just lifting weights whether that's using resistance bands, whether that's swimming in a pool with a big significant resistance, I don't care what you do to get your resistance training in, but if you wanna make brand new brain cells, resistance training is the way to go. So thank you for tuning in again. I'm sorry I look like a half-drowned rat, but I feel my neurochemicals firing and I'm super excited about that. And again, if you have family or friends or loved ones who are concerned about either having a family risk of Alzheimer's disease or they just want to save their brain and be proactive, please like and share this video so that together all of us can help each and everyone save their brains. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you the next time. Bye.